yourself and Andy, uh, you know, you've you've worked on this on your stage show. Did you ever think it was gonna, you know, did you ever want it to go into film? Well, in our wildest dreams and fantasies, but we never thought we would actually we would actually be stood here doing this. Uh, not when we began work on it. Uh, no, it's been I mean it's been an extraordinary journey for both of us, you know, and it's it's still ongoing. So. We pinch ourselves on a regular basis. And it's obviously, you've sort of adapted it a little bit and you've cut it into three chapters as well. I mean, how much of a challenge is that? Uh, it was a challenge because it, it started life as a stage show and it was a very theatrical stage show. So then to put it onto the screen, given that we were taking ideas from horror films and putting them on stage in the first place, to go the other way with it was a big creative challenge, how to do that and how to stop it feeling cliche. And, uh, it was a big job, you know. We spent we spent a long time on the script and uh, and a long time at the other end in the edit, getting it working to our satisfaction. But uh, you know, we got to the point where we were happy with it, thankfully. <laughs> and obviously, this is quite a psychological thriller as mm. well. I mean, do you believe everything that you see? Oh, I'm very careful not to believe everything I see. <laughs> well, that's the other thing is me and Andy share a love of magic and and stage magic and conjuring, and that's a big part of this world. And and when you when you get into the bones of that stuff, it does make you very skeptical about taking things at face value because you realize how uh, easy it is to misperceive things particularly on a dark night when you're on your own <laughs> i've experienced that a few times uh, so also would you uh, you've got a completely different cast as well did you even consider bringing your the, the stage cast uh, well of course andy is reprising the role he played on stage and we do have another of our original cast members although playing a different role nick burns who, uh, who originally played Martin Freeman's role on stage appears in a different role in the uh, in the movie uh, that, what, that didn't exist in the stage version. So you know there is we have got that crossover going on. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey.